In terms of CSP, there has also been an increase. In 2019, there were 6.2 gigawatts installed. In United States and Spain being the countries with the highest share, followed by China, Israel, South Africa and Kuwait. Some of the technologies used in CSP, one of them is parabolic draft concentrators. It is a simple system with a pipe placed in the focus of a parabola and the parabola is focusing and concentrating the radiation through mirrors. These parabolas can be more than five meters wide and they need to track the sun. In this case, a one axis tracking system. Another technology are parabolic dish concentrators. This requires two axis tracking and we can achieve a higher efficiency in, with higher temperatures in the receiver and the fluid is able to generate electricity with a small Stirling engine or a Brighton cycle engine which is attached to the receiver. Power tower technology with heliostats. These are large flat plate mirrors that track the sun in two axes and these mirrors reflect the radiation constantly into a receiver placed on top of a tower. This receiver receives all the rays from an extensive solar field and the largest system without storage is in the USA in Evenpa built in 2014 with 300 92 megawatt electric. With storage, the current largest tower is in Warzazat, Morocco, Africa, with 150 megawatt electric. Another technology is Fresnel collectors. In this image, we can see a compact linear Fresnel system with reflectors. These can reach temperatures above 300 degrees. They can use both steam or a thermal fluid. They can produce direct steam or they can heat up a fluid that can then be used to store and to convey high temperature to the processes needed. Another technology is solar chimney, which has been built in Australia and in Spain. It is actually a large greenhouse, a large area covered by a transparent roof, which has a gently slope into a central tower or chimney. And in this way, there is a movement of air generated by the different temperatures. This is an overview of the technologies we have just discussed with different uh, average annual efficiencies and also different ratios of concentration which has an impact on the operating temperature. All in all, the most popular technology has been the parabolic drafts, both for heating up a fluid and also to produce electricity. This is the percentage of technology throughout the world with and without storage. And in red, we can see the parabolic draft, followed by the linear Fresnel, and after that, the power tower technology and to a very small extent the dish sterling.